hey what's okay this is and in this video i'm going to show you how you can uh, use the gpt for the cyber security purposes and all and there is gpt for that where we suggest you hacking related stuff so without wasting time let's get started and let's see how this model works so guys uh, there is a model for that uh, recently this model name white rabbit neo is uploaded in hugging face and here you can see with the help of this model you can really ask some crazy hacking related stuff and here you can see uh, you can basically uh, erase access for to access this 13 million model in their official page where you can uh, sign up and where you can ask for the 13 million model access and all where well, for timing if you want to use it for your own use i will show you how you can use it use that and there are some uh, license and user restriction is also there do check it out before using it and anyway 13 million uh, 13 million model you can directly use it and there is some code for that if you directly want to use it with the transformer library but before uh there is alternated way of that i already covered it in some of my links and videos you can go check it out from the description also well, uh, let's talk about some sample conversation. Here you can say some user has asked, how do I attack a Wi-Fi network? And it is saying, uh, it is giving some instruction along with some commands and all. And then it's pretty much good stuff it is giving me. Uh, and this Aero, Airmon NG and Aerodome thing, I, I'm a little bit familiar of that. And all these commands and other stuff is related to Wi-Fi hacking and all. So basically, yeah, this model is able to give you some suggestion related to this hacking stuff. Anyway, so if you want to use it, you can directly go with this uh, basic script which is given here. Otherwise, if you don't want to load this heavy model, if you want uh, uh, a GGU architecture model, you can basically load it, uh, which you can run on CPU machines also. And for that, I have already created video, which you can check it out from the description or at the end of the video. Anyway, apart from that, if you want to use it without using any high-end uh, configuration and if you don't know the python stuff you can you can also do that and for that here you can see uh i'm using the uh, lm studio and with the help of lm studio you can just directly load any uh model without uh, knowing any programming languages and all and here you can see basically uh pick social network so here I'm going to ask how to hack social network. Uh, so it's loading and processing and all. So it might take some time. Uh, let me just create a new chat here. So I'm going to create a new chat and I'm going to ask how to hack social network. Meanwhile, it generating its answer. Let me show you my previous chat. Uh, maybe I'm not able to switch in between. So let's wait for a minute. Here you can see that in my local machine where I'm using a CPU based machine, it starts generating some result. It is saying uh, set up a VPN using a secure VPN and all. So here you can see that uh, it starts generating some results. It's saying uh, set up a secure VPN and all, use anonymous email services. Well, uh, I'm going to stop the generation for time being and let me show you my previous chat. Uh, in previous chat, when I say hi, it starts saying set up a GitHub and all. Basically, I don't know why. When, But when I ask like how to hack Wi-Fi, it starts giving me some instruction along with some code like installing tools, scanning a Wi-Fi signals and all, target net, finding the target network, capturing handsets, uh, cracking WPA or WPA2 passwords and using the passwords and all. It's giving me, it's start giving me some instruction or not. But uh, then uh, here you can see that we have again asked how to a social network. So it starts generating the result. Well, this is a CPU machine. It's taking time. That's why I stopped it. But if you having some very good GPU machine, then you can start using this model. So we, we have seen the capabilities of this model. And maybe in future, you can create some uh, length chain agent. One agent is just which is responsible for generating this kind of output and other agents should be responsible for uh, interact with your local machine or computer. And this agent might be able to talk to each other and, and this uh, entire setup of your code might be in, able to interact with your lap own laptop and uh, uh, this JPT will be able to automatically hack someone's Wi-Fi network. So how cool is that? Uh, 
so this kind of activities you can do with the help of this white rabbit your model you can integrate with the auto agent or something like that so that's it for this video i hope you like it and don't forget to do subscribe and also the bell icon to get notification about all of future videos this is the best sign out video soon bye bye